Africa is well known to be a wealth of natural resources, with some of its countries having the potential to be the richest countries in the world. The land here is filled with raw materials, fertile soil, and precious metals. Welcome to AfroPage and thanks for watching. In this video, we will be talking about the top 10 richest countries in Africa for 2020 by taking a look at their GDP. Before then, subscribe and click on the bell icon to get notified any time we upload a new video. Number 10. Sudan. Starting up with the 10th spot on our list today is Sudan. It is a country in Northeast Africa. Sudan has a population of 43 million as of 2018 estimate, and it occupies 728,215 square miles, making it Africa's third largest country, and also the third largest in the Arab world. Much of Africa's wealth lies in raw materials and precious metals, and Sudan is no different. Although it has tried to diversify its economic portfolio, the country would not be where it is today without its oil and gas, making up most of its 60 billion US dollar GDP. Like many of the other rich parts in Africa on this list, Sudan has a heavy reliance on its oil and gas exports. But, in recent times, gold has become one of their main items of trade, as well as sheep and goats. In fact, according to report, Sudan is one of the bigger exporters of sheep and goats in Africa, contributing just under 500 million US dollar to the local economy. Number 9. Ghana. Officially the Republic of Ghana is a country located along the Gulf of Guinea and Atlantic Ocean, in the subregion of West Africa. Spanning a landmass of 238,535 km square. Ghana is bordered by the Ivory Coast in the west, Burkina Faso in the north, Togo in the east, and the Gulf of Guinea and Atlantic Ocean in the south. Ghana is another African country on the rise in terms of economic status. Recently, Ghana has attracted foreign investment due to its wealth of natural resources, and also due to the overall positive business environment it has fostered. Although it has an abundance of natural wealth stored underground, Ghana has come to rely on its other sectors for its financial goals. This diversity has helped it become the second richest country in West Africa. It has a wealth of natural resources, using them in a sustainable and productive manner. Gold is this country's greatest export, followed by petroleum. These two commodities amount to 50% of the country's foreign exchange. From there, Ghana's next big export is cocoa beans, specializing in both the growing and processing of the chocolate-producing nut. Number 8. Ethiopia. On the 8th spot on our list today is Ethiopia. Officially the Federal Democratic Republic of Ethiopia is a landlocked country in the Horn of Africa. With over 109 million inhabitants as of 2019, Ethiopia is the most populous landlocked country in the world and the second most populous nation on the African continent. Ethiopia is one of the fastest growing, non-oil producing countries in Africa. Since 2004, the Ethiopian government has managed to maintain a stable annual growth rate. This stability has obviously begun to attract foreign investment and tourism. The country offers a unique stay to all its visitors, impressing them in ways not often experienced. The natural beauty it boasts is eye-opening, and the Ethiopian culture gives testament to a caring and soulful people. The country produces more coffee than any other nation on the continent. The exportation of coffee provides a livelihood for close to 15 million Ethiopians, amounting to 16% of the country's population. Ethiopia also has the fifth largest inventory of cattle. Other main export commodities are cat, gold, leather products, and oil seeds. Recent development of the floriculture sector means Ethiopia is self-assured to become one of the top flower and plant exporters in the world. Number 7. Kenya. With its established coffee and tea sectors boosting the local trade, and its agriculture beginning to rapidly grow, 
Kenya finds itself being the wealthiest country in Southeast and Central Africa, with a GDP of 105 billion US dollar. Tourism and service industries have become one of the country's major driving forces behind this, as they strive to become the richest nation in Africa. Kenya's major exports are all mainly based on its agricultural sector, with horticulture, coffee, and tea being the primary three. Petroleum also makes up for a part of their foreign exchange, but with tourism on the rise and a world-renowned coffee bean, Kenya is showing signs of healthy diversified growth. Number 6. Angola. Officially the Republic of Angola is a country on the west coast of southern Africa. It is the seventh largest country in Africa, adjoined by Namibia to the south, the Democratic Republic of the Congo to the north, Zambia to the east, and the Atlantic Ocean to the west. Angola has an exclave province, the province of Cabinda that borders the Republic of the Congo and the Democratic Republic of the Congo. The capital and largest city of Angola is Luanda. Angola boasts of some of the biggest reserves of raw materials in Africa. It could have been one of the wealthiest countries in Africa, if not for mismanagement. As it stands, the country's major exports of petroleum and gas are keeping the slow economy buoyant. Angola has diamonds, oil, gold, copper and a rich wildlife, dramatically weakened during the civil war. Since independence, oil and diamonds have been the most important economic resource amount to its GDP of $110 billion. Smallholder and plantation agriculture dramatically dropped in the Angolan Civil War, but began to recover after 2002. The transformation industry of the late colonial period collapsed at independence because of the exodus of most of the ethnic Portuguese population, but it has begun to re-emerge with updated technologies, partly because of an influx of new Portuguese entrepreneurs. Similar developments have taken place in the service sector. Number 5. Morocco. Taking the fifth spot today on the richest African countries for 2020 is Morocco. It is a known fact that oil plays a major factor in determining a country's wealth in Africa. In the case of Morocco, it has instead had to rely on its agriculture, tourism, and closeness to Europe to help its economy. It stands as the third largest producer of phosphorus in the world in the second richest non-oil producing country in Africa, with a GDP of 125 billion US dollar. The Moroccans are proud of their heritage and have placed a strong emphasis on tourism to attract visitors to their country. They are well known for their luxury holidays and high quality attractions. Morocco relies heavily on its agriculture and phosphorus when considering exports. However, the country is also a major distributor of electrical equipment, vehicles, and vehicle parts. Its economy has benefited greatly from its diversified exports, considering it doesn't have the luxury of raw materials. Number 4. Algeria. Algeria is a country situated in the northern parts of Africa. They are one of the rapidly growing industrial country that has recently found itself on the up. Due to the recent discovery of more crude oil reserves. Today, the raw material makes up over 60% of the country's income. With a GDP of over 175 billion US dollar, Algeria is starting to grow its infrastructure under its ambitious government, with the goal of becoming one of the wealthiest countries in Africa. Algeria has discovered extra natural reserves of petroleum and oil in its land, giving an added boost to its already growing economy. It has recently begun refining the raw material and increased exportation of this and oil. Less known export from Algeria would be ammonia. The country is one of the largest suppliers of ammonia in Africa. Number 3. Egypt. Officially the Arab Republic of Egypt is a transcontinental country spanning the northeast corner of Africa and southwest corner of Asia by a land bridge formed by the Sinai Peninsula. This land of the pharaohs is third on this list, with a GDP of almost 315 billion US dollar. Surprisingly, the country's economy is actually very stable, despite the political turmoil. This country is a bit of a contradiction. 
where on one side is endless desert, on the other, is the bountiful Nile River. Under the sand, Egyptians have been able to draw petroleum and gold for exporting, making up much of their income. However, the nitrogenous fertilizers processed from its more fertile areas, such as the Nile River and Delta, have also played a vital role in maintaining Egypt's stable economy. Number 2. South Africa. The southernmost African country holds the position of being the second wealthiest African country. It's also known as one of the fastest developing countries in the world. Its GDP currently sits at almost 380 US dollar. The country has always been endowed with superabundant amounts of natural resources, specifically gold, diamonds, platinum, and coal. Political turmoil has hampered its ability to meet its full potential, however. South Africa is one of the only countries in Africa that don't rely on a single source of revenue, they are diversified. It places a lot of emphasis on its tourism and well-known nature reserves as a means of assisting its economy. South Africa is one of the most bountiful countries in the world when it comes to raw potential. Its soil is fertile for crops, its earth filled with minerals and raw material. It's unfortunate that the country's political turmoil hinders its development. When it comes to exports, few countries surpass South Africa's gold, diamond and platinum production. For years it was the main exporter of these commodities. Other exports include grain, bananas, and, recently, macadamia nuts. Number 1. Nigeria. As of the end of 2019, Nigeria holds the position of the richest country in Africa, with a GDP of almost 600 billion US dollar. Its 160 million people have helped the country propel itself to be the largest consumer retailer in Africa, along with its petroleum exports. The vast abundance of crude oil, making up more than 85% of the country's foreign exchange, is what drives this country's economy. Although having not diversified away from its petroleum production, Nigeria's oil market funds the majority of its other ventures. The country is Africa's largest crude oil exporter, recording production about 1.6 million barrels a day in December of 2019. Petroleum exports account for 10% of GDP and exceed 80% of export revenue. Apart from petroleum, Nigeria's other natural resources include natural gas, tin, iron ore, coal, limestone, and iodium, lead, zinc and arable land. Between 2000 and 2014, Nigeria grew its GDP year-on-year year by 7%, one of the fastest rates in Africa. However, growth has since slowed to around 2% due to oil and production shocks, and with political instability in the region and a growing young and unemployed population, Nigeria is expected to grow slowly and living conditions to worsen. Also, with the 2020 crude oil price war between Saudi Arabia, Russia and the US, and the impacts of COVID-19, it's possible Nigeria won't hit its growth target of 2%. That bring us to the end of this video. Thanks for watching, and before you go, tell us your country in the comments section below, and don't forget to give this video a like, share and also subscribe to this channel for more interesting videos.